What's good guys, it's Combat here at Infinite Rhythm Productions and today I'm gonna show y'all three tips to get your vocals brighter. Let's get into it. Combat, this is a banger, huh? All right, so I have this song by Polo Money over here. It's called How You Left Me. I'm gonna play it out a little bit. Ain't trying to go back to no old ways. I wanna thank y'all for the hate to let me know I'm great. I told my bitch I'm done with drink, but I just bought a eight. Been elevating not the way I ain't been showing face. So my first tip of getting your vocals brighter is making sure your vocal frequencies aren't competing with the beat frequencies. And a lot of the times, especially in hip hop, rap, and all that stuff, we see people just take beats off of YouTube, right? Or they only work with the two track beat, whether it's an MP3 wave, whatever it is. So a lot of time when we have something like that, we're not able to really like make sure we can mix all the individual parts of the beat stems so that way the vocals could really sit in. Maybe we could get that brighter sound that we're really looking for. So a way to go around it is just making sure that you either have an EQ on the beat itself. So right here I have Ozone 10. I have an EQ right here. I have, I'm lowering the lows a little bit, raising up the highs a little bit. I'll just solo out the beat. You feel me? So I just lower the lows a little bit. Raise up the highs. So I have a little bit of a stabilizer right here. It just has like a hip hop setting right here. Helps controls the frequencies a little bit. Then I also have this imager right here. So I have a little bit of a mono going with the lower frequencies and a little bit of a higher stereo with the, the higher frequencies. Now with the vocals, as you guys can see, I take out the low end right here. So I cut, I put a, a high pass or I put a low pass filter right here around 88 right here hertz. Usually I keep it around 80 to 100 hertz just really depending on the, the artist's vocals. And I'm pretty much gonna cut that. I'm gonna show you guys a before and after. I wanna thank y'all for the hate let me know I'm great. I told my bitch I'm done with drink, but I just bought a hate. Been elevating not the way I ain't been. So that already sounds a lot better just by cutting out the lows. So what's happening is the low end of the vocals aren't interfering with the low end of the beat because there's, there's a lot of bass and everything in there. So if you had it competing and they're bothering each other, you're going to get more of a muddy signal. So it's funny, a lot of the time you feel like when you want brighter vocals, you just want to raise up this high end over here and that's it. You just get brighter vocals. But a lot of the time you guys are hearing harshness on the high end. You guys are not hearing good dynamics with the vocals is either going up and down. That's because it's not actually your, your vocals don't actually need more high end. It just needs to not interfere with the beat. You know what I'm saying? They're just, it's just too much competing frequencies. So that is the first tip that could really brighten up your vocals. So another way to brighten up your vocals is simply making an auxiliary track and putting an exciter on there. So I'm going to show you guys. I have my track already over here with the exciter. I'm just going to show you guys real fast how to make one. You just go command shift N, do a right air, command right arrow key, command uh, down arrow key. You get the stereo and aux. I just hit return. Boom. I'm going to uh, put a certain input that I want. Right here, I put the vocal exciter. Then I have this going to my Vox Verse sub right now. Now, you guys just pretty much pick an exciter that you guys want. Uh, right here, I am using the Ozone X10 exciter. I'll show you guys right here. This is my Ozone 10 exciter. I pretty much just have certain frequencies selected. So I have these right here. And I just pretty much raise them up with a, a warm tone. So there's different type of tones you can kind of have that kind of give it tones, different tones really, um, between each frequency. I just like the warm tone and I kind of bring that up. So what I'm gonna do is, is go into my main track. And then I'm just gonna go to where that Vox, that, that bus sub is, and which is the Vox exciter right here. I'm just gonna click that. Boom. I wanna thank y'all for the hate let me know I'm great. I told my bitch I'm done with drink, but I just bought a eight. Been elevating out the way I ain't been showing face. And then from there, I'll just add as much as I want. That's the way I liked it for this exciter. I could always add more high end or whatever if I wanted more of the, the brighterness to it. Um, for this exciter, I kind of add a little bit more of the, the mid highs, like I want to say, uh, just to kind of add in more fullness to the vocal. And now for our third tip to get brighter vocals, I would suggest a super, super easy way would just be Fresh Air by Slate Digital. Um, it's a free plugin. It's super easy to use and it brightens up your vocals instantly. So I'll show you guys right here. So I'm just gonna go over here to my plugins. I'm gonna go to my Slate Digital and then I'm gonna go to my Fresh Air. Then I'm just gonna raise it up and just show you guys what it does. Wait. I wanna thank y'all for the hate let me know I'm great. I told my bitch I'm done with drink, but I just bought a eight. Been elevating not the way I ain't been showing. So that's the mid air right there, and I'll show you what the high air does. Wait. 
I wanna thank y'all for the hater, let me know I'm great. I told my bitch I'm done with drink, but I just bought an eight. Been elevating out the way I ain't. So between those two, you just kinda wanna adjust accordingly, so. Wait. I wanna thank y'all for the hater, let me know I'm great. I told my bitch I'm done. So if I wanted brighter vocals instantly, this is what I do. I hear this is the bypass. Wait. I wanna thank y'all for the hater, let me know I'm great. with it. Wait. I wanna thank y'all for the hater, let me know I'm great. I told my bitch I'm done with drink, but I just Awesome, now that concludes our tutorial of three tips of how to get your vocals brighter. I hope this really helped you guys out. Now, if you guys have any other questions, please feel free to contact me on Instagram at combat underscore K. I'll make sure to leave a link in the description. And if you guys need any free templates or presets, I actually have them out on my website right now, www.infinitrhythmpresets.com. I have a lot of free samples on there, as well as a lot of templates and presets for you guys to use at home. We have clear vocal presets, essential hip hop presets, as well as some telephone effects expansion packs that just dropped got a lot of good stuff and if you guys could like comment and subscribe that helps me out a lot so i continue to help you guys out let's get it